For the first time ever, you can designate your site name on mobile search within Google, and I'm going to teach you how to do it. So on October 14th, for the first time, Google came out with a new thing you can do for mobile search. You can now indicate your preferred site name using structured data. Site names are currently available for mobile Google search results in English, French, Japanese, and German. And they're also going to be rolling out to additional languages over the next few months. Now, Google currently relies on a variety of different sources to help determine what your site name is in mobile search. But if you want to indicate your preferred site name, you can do that. Basically, you can use structured data on your homepage to tell Google what the site name should be. And if you want more information on how to do this, check out the site name documentation. But also, I'm going to pull up an example for you on the screen. Here you can see what the site name documentation looks like and what you need to do with the structured data so that you can have this showing up correctly in mobile search for your site name. Now, also, when Google came out with this blog post, they also recommended revisiting the documentation for favicons. That's going to allow you to have a little favicon with your logo, smiley face, whatever you want. Yes, you should be using structured data to specify your site name in Google mobile search and probably putting a favicon on your website as well. That's an action item for you. If you like this video, give me a like, give me a comment. I always appreciate it. I'll see you next time. Goodbye.